Hello everyone, welcome to Art of Testing. In this video, we are going to learn about software testing life cycle and its various phases. So, in the earlier days of software development, testing was considered as a single phase and was performed only after the coding or the implementation phase. But after the evolution of software development process and with the increasing complexity of software applications, the testing activities were defined to ensure effective software testing. This led to the evolution of software testing lifecycle. Now, let's check its formal definition. Software testing lifecycle or STLC refers to a series of systematic and well-defined steps performed during the testing of a software application. Coming to some advantages of STLC now. The testing team gets involved right from the initial phases of software development lifecycle. This helps in a better understanding of application which results in overall better testing. It ensures lesser project cost and timely delivery since the testing team can uncover bugs and anomalies quickly by following a systematic test process. Each STLC phase has a well-defined goal and deliverable so it helps in measuring the progress with the different milestone achieved in each phase. Let's move to the different STLC phases now. Requirement Analysis in this phase, the testing team understands the requirement and analyzes all the requirement documents. Along with that, the scope of testing is defined as to what all features can and will be tested and what all features will be out of scope of the testing activities. Test Planning and Control Test planning is one of the most important activities in the test process. It involves defining the test specifications in order to achieve the project requirements. Here, the resource allocation for carrying out testing, the number of test cases to be created, testing duration, and the cost gets finalized. Test control includes continuous monitoring of the test process with a set plan along with the escalation of an deviation to the concerned stakeholders. Test case development. This phase involves the actual test case creation. It also involves the specification of test data and the automated test scripts creation using different automation tools like Selenium WebDriver, Catalan Studio, Test Complete, etc. Test Environment Setup This phase involves the creation of test environment closely simulating the real world environment. The testing team uses this environment to test the whole application with different types of testing. Test Execution this phase involves manual and automated test case execution. During test case execution, any deviation from the expected result leads to creation of defects in a defect management tool like Jira, Bugzilla, Mantis, etc. Once the development team fixes the bugs, the bugs are retested for validation. Test Closer This phase marks the formal closure of testing. It involves checking if all the project deliverables are delivered, archiving the testware, and the test environment along with the documentation of learning. This completes our tutorial on STLC. See you in our next video. Thank you.